how to insert increase and decrease arrow based on percentage change in Microsoft Excel. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this intermediate Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you an excellent trick. Using this, you will be able to insert trend arrows in Microsoft Excel. Let's get started. <laughs> Take a look at this worksheet we have stock data and we have percentage here and i want to format it in a way if we have a positive number we'll be able to see the up arrow beside the number if it's a negative percentage i want a red down arrow and if it's zero or no change i want a blue line okay for that i'm going to select on any cell and i'm going to click on insert and symbols from here i'm going to select three icons the up arrow and click insert then the down arrow and here the dash and i'm going to insert it okay and i have found these icons in the aerial font and geometric shapes okay so i have done that and i'm going to close it now we have three arrows and i'm going to copy them okay now select the range where you want to insert your positive and negative percentage change arrows so i'm going to select this entire column and i'm going to press ctrl 1 it will open a format cell or you can right click and click here format cell it will be in the same position then i'm going to select custom here we have percentage and we have zero here and i'm going to paste the icon here okay first option will be for our up arrow so we have pasted only the up arrow here and then we have percentage 0, 0.00 this will be for all the positive percentage okay and now at the beginning i want to add within square bracket green g r w -E n okay so we have formatted all the positive numbers here first we have added green the color and then we have added the icon that we want to use and then we have specified this green color arrow is for all the positive percentage okay now i'm going to add a semicolon here i'm going to use the same format right equal to and we have pasted our down arrow icon here and i'm going to write here within square bracket red okay so our down arrow will be in red along with the percentage so for that we are going to write the percentage here also after the semicolon this part is for all the negative inputs okay if my percentage is negative then we will show a down arrow in red now i'm going to add another semicolon and here we are going to specify what we want to do if we have no change or we have zero in our percentage column so i'm going to paste the icon here again this is the icon i want here and in square bracket i want to add blue this is the color i want and then i'm going to write the percentage okay so this is the format i want and if i click ok and you can see our formatting has been changed already and if i click here we have the icon and we have green for each percentage and if i scroll down here we have the zero value which is in blue and we have the negative so this is how you insert positive and negative percentage change in microsoft excel this is what i wanted to show you if you think this video is helpful please like it and share it with your friends if you can support the channel through patreon and don't forget to subscribe thank you thanks for watching